how small it is. Let's try to get it out. Around the neck. Why are you biting? There are a lot around the neck. Calm down, baby. Of course, the quality of the first minutes of the video is not very good, but we haven't been ready to shoot that. You never know who will need your help and where. We found a squirrel in a city park. If to be more accurate, this is not us, but an old lady has said that there is a squirrel among the trees. It has got tangled in the fishing line. Well, at least thanks for that she had said. There are a lot of stray dogs here. We do not know how everything could end. Well, your bite so much, it hurts a lot. Having spent about 20 minutes, it becomes clear that we won't be able to free the squirrel just like that. We've decided to take it to the hangar. Guys, don't leave rubbish after yourselves. A harmless fishing line can cost the life of a little squirrel. It is still biting. Jack, look what we have found here in the park. We cannot say that it has been too difficult to free the squirrel from the fishing line, but at once it seems to be much easier. This is such an active and mobile animal that I have to aim with scissors 20 times before I manage to cut the line. We are afraid to prick inadvertently, despite the fact that this is a baby and it bites with its teeth very unpleasantly. After the release, we think the baby squirrel will run away. But it turns out to be quite calm and even begins to clean its fur, washing itself. Now it knows it is safe. We want to help it and not hurt it. Human beastliness could kill such a beautiful animal. When it becomes clear that the danger has passed, the rat hat decides to relax and falls asleep. We definitely don't expect this. And being safe, it has also felt such stress. It needs to calm its emotions and relax. To tell the truth, squirrels are very timid and their sleep is very sensitive. It jumps up at any rustle. While the squirrel is sleeping, we have bought several types of nuts and raisins. Judging by its size, it is quite small. It's hard to estimate the age, but it's older than 8 weeks if it's separated from its mom, or vice versa, it's younger than 8 weeks, and then somewhere in the forest its family is waiting for it to go home. And we've also read sad statistics that almost 80% of young animals do not live up to a year and die for various reasons. Anyway, the squirrel must be returned to the wild. We return to the place where we have picked up the red hat and let it go in peace. The squirrel becomes so attached to us that it doesn't want to leave. And it prefers to run around me, but not to be back. Of course, we are flattered by such behavior and are already thinking of keeping it. But it looks like it is farewell. The redhead climbs up to the very top of the tree and then jumps from tree to tree and sits looking at us from a height. As soon as we are about to leave, the squirrel comes down and follows us. Now I'm like a mother kangaroo. Of course we love animals, we often make videos with them. No wonder that the hype raccoon is the main mascot of our channel. Now we have to build a house for the squirrel. We have to wait until it grows up and gets stronger and let it out into the street. We've bought some timbers. We have got a layout of the aviary in our mind. Let's go to assemble the frame. The wooden skeleton is only the beginning. The next step is to cover the frame with a metal mesh. The size of the squirrel's house will be 7 feet high, 7 feet wide and 14 feet long. There will be enough place to roam in such an aviary.
it remains to hand the doors and we are done with the exterior. Then we move on to the interior. We will create conditions for the squirrel that are as close as possible to the wild, and even better. Everyone has heard about the squirrel wheel. It is used for small domestic rodents, hamsters, chipmunks, and of course for squirrels. It is not in vain that it is named after this animal. As our new guest has a luxury house, the wheel is a must-have part for the interior. And there are no such sizes for sale as we want. And we don't need it, we can do it ourselves. A wheel for a squirrel will be the same size as a bicycle one. To make the story short, there will be where to accelerate. We've taken out a small generator and a board to turn the squirrel's driving force into electricity. It remains to assemble and we will charge the phone for free. Well, not for free, for a couple of knots. I connect my phone and enjoy. We have prepared a few more interesting things in addition to the wheel for the squirrel. It is a wooden staircase that will lead to a hanging hammock. Elephants are said to be able to travel hundreds of kilometers looking for some salt. Squirrels don't need such travels. We also don't forget about the salt stone. All nuances are taken into account. And now our work is ready for delivery to a potential resident. It's time to show the little rat hat its new makeshift home. We don't know how long it will live with us, but the sad statistics says that 4 out of 5 baby squirrels die in the first winter. And we want to break this trend at least a little. So the baby will probably stay with us until spring. By the way, we collectively name it Sebastian. Now we are responsible for the one we have tamed. We have to find out the squirrel's diet yet, so let's start with peanuts, almonds and raisins. The only thing we have not been able to explain to the squirrel is how to use the wheel. We have shown by our own example and tried to twirl, but Google says squirrels do not understand what kind of miracle machine it is up to 6 months, and why do we even need to charge the phone. But it understands what a bell is and why it is needed on YouTube at all. I think a lot of people are interested. What happens if a raccoon meets a squirrel? What will be the reaction of the raccoon and the squirrel? A 
At first, the raccoon doesn't understand at all why it is brought to this cage. It doesn't understand at once that there is someone besides it. There are much more interesting things. They are manholes, transitions, a bunch of stumps that can be turned over. Even a raccoon climbs on the house before it realizes it is alone. But a squirrel is 10 times faster than a raccoon, therefore the acquaintance turns out to be only visual. This is all for now. Bye-bye!